natural. Ours was good. Ours was all natural. Ours was good actors. No, we didn't mean Ours it like that. Ours was good because it's No, no, not like natural. fake things. Like, you didn't put a scene together at all? Wow. Guys, he's annoying, but he's the films. Bossy? Yeah, he doesn't take anybody's suggestions. Dude, he mine thinks he knows what's going on. Mine was good. I think the other team kind of has planned out who they want to leave, and I think we all kind of agree on it, so no matter who loses, I think we both know who's going to win. We wouldn't let him do anything he wanted to do. You know, like anything he was saying, like, we wouldn't any of his ideas. He did everything he wanted to do. And all he wanted to do was do his little editing stuff, and I'm like, let the guy do it, you know? Yeah, and he was like, we put him off to the last one. Jimmy, Jimmy um, is trying to psych people out. And it's kind of worrying me because he's playing mind games. And Jimmy, I know you're playing mind games, OK? So you can't get that past me. They didn't do, they didn't really take me to my Really? I have a gut feeling that if we, if we, take, if we take the loss this time, I have a feeling that despite whatever my performance is, my my neck's on the line, you know? Yeah. Hmm? James knows that it's between him and okay, me. But basically, from what you guys have told us, it's changing. Hi. Um, if their decisions come under fire, you're pretty much involved. You say, hey, I didn't do that. I have no idea. Yeah. We're screwed. It was awesome. Yeah, she Jeff, was we're, we're a little off. Our team screwed. Mason or James going home. That's what we have to figure out. Now, right the now. thing is, is that right now, James knows that it's between him and Mason. Did James edit the whole thing? No, no. James tried to, and that's what set us back. your breakfast, but uh, I had a rather important announcement to make. The executives from the Fair Housing Council will not be here today. It turns out that uh, they're not the ones who actually judged your documentaries. And uh, I would like you to meet the people who actually did evaluate your films. So please say hello to this week's judges. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Whoa, okay. What is this? Get the heck up out of here. The cost of living has just skyrocketed. It's so astronomical, and uh, the work market is so volatile. We see each other, um, and when we get home, so we see each other. We spend time with each other maybe for 15, 20 minutes, and we sleep. The extra time I could spend with my family, you know, two hours extra instead of spending it commuting. You know, it's it's very hard doing the commuting. My wife and I, we could go out to dinner more often. I get to spend more time with my son, you know, play with my son, be a family functions. First one, the family kind of stated that they knew what it was, that they got it. The second one, they didn't, I guess I was looking more for the education of the family to kind of say it, and they didn't. Well, the first that. one also, at, at the end, it gave an address of where you can find it in the Valley of Michigan, right. whereas yeah, the I'm second one did not. Right. So if you're trying to find out information about this, you're not going to be able to in the second one. That's true. 
but I think that I was more moved by the first round. The, the way they opened, um, I think, was actually a little more, a little more emotionally impacting the second one. So the second film kind of showed how how little the child is and how it's going to have such an effect um, of his everyday life being so little and how it's going to change tomorrow's world because he's still going to be commuting when that child's the age of the first child. Um, all those in favor of the blue? I'll go for blue. Yeah, I think that was the uh, yeah, I think we have a good chance. I'm not 100% sure we're going to win, but I, would, I think we have a good chance to win. Both were very good, and the hardest part was trying to make sure we made the right choice for the kids as well, because we did not know whose team our child was on. Hi, Mom. Hi. This is creepy. Yeah, this is a <laughs> We were voting it was almost like a collective experience you know and everybody was kind of in the same mindset and, and it was just hard to vote you know know somebody was going to be voted off i'd like to introduce to you uh miss olga hernandez who is going to actually announce the winning team today oh. <laughs> first film that we saw um was very emotional and because it told about a commute and that's something that i do every day and uh, the little girl happened to be a teenager, and so I felt the pain of that, and my son happened to be on that team. One team received seven votes, and the other team received eight. So it was really, really close. <laughs> Every one of our group members' parents voted for our team. It was very hard, we all want you to know. <laughs> but in the end, the yellow team won. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we were shocked about the parents being involved in this decision in any way. This week, the prizes goes to the family for their participation in the show. As our way of saying thank you, you will receive a gift basket filled with environmentally friendly household products. Now, the blue team will have to decide who will leave the house. You will have 30 minutes to make your decision. I will meet you back in the panel room. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I mean, the votes were very close. We had one less vote than the other team, so you know it was kind of hard to be compatible. I think it really was that we just didn't have time. We had so many ideas we wanted to put in, and I feel like if we had the time to do it, that we would have won. But of course, you know, someone has to lose, and unfortunately, it was our team. Hello guys, how are you? Hi, good. Good. Do you have a good weekend? Yeah. I know you've been through a lot this weekend. You worked very hard and as we heard earlier from your parents, the decision was very hard. Both documentaries, videos were incredible. Now you're going to have to make a decision today of who's going to leave. Uh, but before we do that, I want you to know that um, you are our original ambassadors. We're all going to be counting on you to take the Green Valley initiative ahead. So no matter what happens today, you still have a lot to accomplish and you still have already accomplished a lot to be here today. So we really, really appreciate all of your hard work and, and in, in our mind, you're all winners. Voting for this person because I feel he's too smart and he's going to be strong later on in the competition. And I can't deal with that. I'm voting for this person because he's kind of a threat because he won last week and this week he wasn't really an attribute to our group. I'm voting for this person mainly because he's my biggest threat. He stood back on this challenge, I feel, and didn't do a lot of work. And because I have alliances with the other three people on the team, so that's just how it is. Um. The 
first vote goes to Christian. I'm voting for Christian. Um, I'm voting for this person because they weren't really a necessity this week, so. The second one also goes to Christian. Now, if you get one more Christian, you would be uh, Ashley. I'm voting for Ashley. Alright, um, I voted for this person because as leader of our group, it was this person's uh, obligation to make sure we have the best product. And ultimately, everything falls to the responsibility of the leader, so that's, that's my choice right there. Christian, Christian, uh, you have the most votes. Uh, I'm really sorry, but uh, your association with this team will end here. Thank you. Sorry. Sorry. It's all the human vocabulary, like, scared. <laughs> <laughs> you lost me. I never got to sleep, you guys. <laughs> you did, no. Sorry, right, I'm not. I, I'm sad. But, uh, at least I'm not dead. Yeah. Three, two, yeah. one more, Kim. Two, one more. I'm freaking good for this question. Put us all to shame. I know, before I was sad, then they're like, oh, and I was like, oh, okay, that's cool. So yeah, true. Yeah, really. Yeah, really. Yeah, really. Yeah, you, uh, getting everything Why am I so good at this? <laughs> I don't know. I guess maybe I was just uh, too good for everybody else. <laughs> um, obviously, I don't feel great about being eliminated, but um, I had a great time while I was here, and uh, I was telling the other people I made it to 33.33% to the show. <laughs> so that's that's significant. Yeah.